the definition of marriage is one man and one woman. It's been that for millennia. And what they're saying is, we want to completely destroy that. I mean, what's, what is the limiting? There are people who are marrying themselves. Somebody wanted to marry a tree. Um, people marrying their pets. Anything goes being elevated into our Constitution. I've read the 14th Amendment thousands of times. I don't see anything about right to same-sex marriage. I don't see anything saying right to homosexuality. I don't see anything about right to privacy. I don't see any of those things. As bad as you think it is, it's worse. So what we're going to talk about are the legal attacks that that group of individuals and their surrogates are unleashing on the rest of the country and what you can do to, to protect yourselves. Colorado uh, public school has been school has been sued because a first grader and I forget the sex she's a girl who thinks she's a boy or a boy who thinks she's a girl it's, but still a first grader really knows what their sexual identity I mean it's just it's just I mean it just shows you how Satan's plan is working and the destruction that's going on and the states believe that in order to protect children, the best place for a child is to be raised by one man and one woman. Well, what about adoption and foster care? If you receive any governmental support, then they're saying in their contracts, well, you can't discriminate. You've got to say, we won't discriminate on the basis of 